With the arrow peak feature, you can quickly see down to your desktop through clutter windows around your desktop. Simply place your mouse over the show desktop icon located on the bottom right corner of your screen. This will turn all of your windows into transparent windows so you can see down to your desktop. To go back, take your mouse over the show desktop icons and your windows will become opaque. With the new Windows 7 arrow shake feature, you can quickly get rid of unactive windows that are lying in the background. To do so, shake the current window that you're working with to minimize them all. To get them back, shake the same window and then return back to their same location. With the new arrow snap feature, you can easily compare and contrast two separate documents without switching back and forth between windows. To do so, simply drag, drag each window to its respective side of the screen, where it will take up half the size of your screen. This way, it makes it easier to compare and contrast documents without switching back and forth. Jump lists allow you to easily access your application without it being open. To do so, right click over its icon in the taskbar. You'll be able to see the most common tasks for that particular application. Opening a browser will show you the most visited websites as well as the most recently closed tabs for that application. Right clicking over folders, will show you the most frequent folders and files that were just opened. Right -click clicking over Windows Media Player, or any type of media player such as DivX or VLC, will show you the most frequent videos open with that player, as well as common tasks like Play All and Resume Previous List. With the new Jump List feature, you'll be able to easily access your application without even opening it to your current window. In Windows 7, you can easily personalize your desktop to your liking. To add gadgets to your desktop, right click on your desktop, go down to Gadgets. Here, you'll see all of the pre-packed gadgets that come along with Windows 7. To add one to your desktop, simply drag it from this window to the location where you'd like it to be. I'm going to add a clock and the weather my desktop. To get more gadgets, you can go to the Microsoft website and download them there. If you click this link, it will take you directly to the Microsoft website. To change the wallpaper, right click on your desktop, go down to Personalize. Here, you'll see all the different types of wallpapers and themes for the Windows 7 operating system. You can change your wallpaper to a static, non-changing wallpaper, or you can change it to a slideshow where your wallpaper will change in a specified amount of time. For this demo, I'll change it to 10 seconds and shuffle it. Now, our wallpaper will change every 10 seconds. With the Windows 7 taskbar, you can easily pin your favorite, most common applications to the bottom. Simply drag the icon to the taskbar where it will pin in place. You can easily change the order by dragging the icon to the location where you would like it to be. When it becomes active, you can see that 
its icon becomes more opaque than the others. This way, you can easily identify active applications. If you roll over the icon, you can see a little preview of what that application has in real time. Opening other applications, you can see that the same feature applies to them as well. You can pin other applications off the Windows taskbar as well. Simply drag it down to the taskbar and place it, put it in place. 